Okay, next one is from Callum Beard, a Scottish singer-songwriter, and it's called Some Call This Normal. And Callum sent, him the, sent us this in March, about a month before the actual release date. The song's song's out now, so you can yeah. listen to it wherever, wherever you get your music. And it's a collaboration between Callum and a German musician called Tobias Thiel, or Thiel, I'm not sure exactly how you pronounce his name. And uh, it's heavily influenced by contemporary folk music and Callum said in his email that this track is for anyone trying to maintain a positive outlook amidst seemingly never-ending negative developments in the world from covid to war to climate change which leave us all feeling like everything is coming apart at the seams what did you make of this I quite enjoyed it I would say that it kind of did I never actually realized it was a collaboration between Callum Baird and the kind of German yeah, a uh, guy that you were kind of speaking about. Um, I did feel as if it was a kind of pretty straightforward acoustic number. Opens with your favourite slide guitar, or there's elements <laughs> of of that in there. I think it, it immediately kind of put me in mind the likes of Jerry Cinnamon, but I think that's maybe just because of the kind of Scottish accent being accompanied with a kind of acoustic guitar. I don't know. Yeah, um, yeah I can see that. I mean, he, he does sing in a kind of unashamedly. Um, Scottish accent, which, which is great, you know. I mean, I think it's always always really nice to, to hear people kind of singing in their own accents rather than trying to put on like a full American or transatlantic kind of accent. Yeah, I mean, I th- I thought that the, the lyrics were quite good. You know, what I mean, it uh, certainly encapsulates encapsulates how we're all feeling at the moment, and uh, you know, encapsulates some of the, the arguments that I've had recently. You know, almost about kind of striving for something a bit more. Um, or for a kind of better quality of life and or a kind of existence uh, with lyrics such as some call this normal like this is all there can be but this strange moving drama is getting darker as far as I can see it's almost like yeah, but, okay but we, we shouldn't be happy with our lot we should be striving for a better better world yeah you met you mentioned Jerry Cinnamon I can see why why you're making that comparison but I think Callum Beard's got a much better singing voice Jerry Cinnamon does like I think he double tracks all his vocals or at least it sounds like he does yeah. um but and yeah he's he's all right but um I think I think Callum's got a much stronger singing voice quite quite a commanding voice I think that he's got and kind of makes you sit up and take notice I mean I, I compare him a little bit to to Michael Timmons, I suppose. Um, he's got that kind of light Scottish twang, but you know you can clearly hear everything he says and understand mm-hmm. everything he says, which is what you want when you're trying to tell kind of relatable stories, I suppose. Yeah. Um, and yeah, it's mostly Callum with an acoustic guitar and that little bit of slide guitar. I, I quite, I quite like it. Uh, the slide guitar, actually, which is, and there's more slide guitar on the set. I, I think as well. you like slide. I think uh, you like closet, slide guitar, man. Closet fan of slide guitar um <laughs> so yeah i quite like that i mean it adds a little bit of a country vibe to the mix um there's yeah. a little bit of like warbling organ in the background there as well and uh it doesn't change up too much kind of over its sort of four minute runtime but there are some good guitar parts even there and there's a nice like short-lived vocal harmony about two thirds of the way through which is a quite a big moment on the song and a memorable moment anyway and like you say the lyrics I've picked out a couple of kind of lyrics that I liked here um, everyone's misbelieving that believing is run aground there's tears in the fabric and the whole thing feels a little unwound and later on the song you know I'm so sick of saying I feel so estranged burnt out and washed up it all feels the same and there's there's quite a few things about this that I like yeah I think it's worth noting as well that you know just over four minutes it could potentially feel like quite a long song, but I, I didn't. Well, I don't get that impression listening to it at all. You know what I mean? It doesn't feel like four minutes, if that makes sense. No, it does. It, there's there's enough going on to to stop it from getting getting old, and you sort of like looking at your watch halfway through, kind of thing. Yeah, totally. And um, uh-huh. there's there's enough going on. So yeah, like this kind of sort of folky trad sort of stuff. It's not it's not really my bad. My my bag, as I've said before, but but yeah, I find myself really enjoying this. Mm-hmm. It's interesting to see that he, um, I think from what I read online as well, uh, he kind of draws his influences from the likes of Billy Bragg and stuff like that. I think he's actually playing at St. Luke's in Glasgow tonight. Is that oh, really? 
Nice. It's a pretty good venue. Pretty good That's, venue. Uh, yeah, I've only been the once, but um, it sounded like an impressive venue. Like, yeah, definitely. Um, was that for the Jamie Lenman gig? Yeah, yeah, for yeah. the Road to Lenmania, wasn't it? I think it was called. Mm-hmm. So yeah, I'd, I'd like to go back to St. Luke's. It's a cool venue. So I've I've given this an eight, an eight out of ten. I think that's fair to say, man. I've said I've said a seven or eight out of ten for me. Yeah, there's um a few more of his songs on on Spotify. I haven't listened through them all, but one one that I did listen to is called Fur Ewig or Fur Ewig. Oh, I don't yeah. I don't know how you pronounce that, and that's a really so is that good a song. collaboration as well then? Pass. I don't know. Probably yeah. probably not because the collaboration that was specifically mentioned in the email for this release. Mm. So that's probably you know. I think it's just him and his acoustic guitar on that one, actually. But that, like, if you like Callum's voice on this song, then Fur, you, I don't have no idea how to pronounce that. Fur Ewig, Ewig. Um, yeah, it's it's. I make it like I was wondering whether it was a part of the collaboration because it does sound quite German, doesn't it? Because it's got it's got the accent above the U, doesn't it? Yeah, but I don't I don't know I don't know don't know. Um, but yeah, like I said, that is. That's a really, really good song. So I'd recommend that to anyone. As, as I would this. As I would this song too. Yeah, so that was um, Some Call This Normal by Callum Baird. Well, everyone's chasing the sunshine Cause these days it ain't here for very long There's tears in the fabric And the whole thing Feels a little unwound Some call this normal Like this is all that can be You know I'm so sick of saying I feel so estranged Finish. It's finished.